Hello everyone, and thanks for tuning in to this episode of The Nerd Closet. This episode is going to serve as sort of an epilogue for the previous two how-tos that I posted. I have two quick tips for you in the form of questions that arose while I was making the other two videos. So, here we go. Tip number one. What if I don't have someone to help me mark my new hemline? In the two previous videos, I showed you a quick way to find where you might want your new hem to be. But it did require a second set of hands. There is another way to find your desired hemline and it requires a tape measure and a separate pair of pants that already have the hem you want. Take a pair of pants that you know have the right hem length and lay them on a flat surface. Using your measuring tape, measure the length of the inseam. The number you get will be the length of your new hemline, so make sure that you write it down. Repeat this same step on the pants that you want to hem, placing a pin at the measurement you just got. Then you're ready to hem your pants. Okay, now let's take a look at tip number two. What if I don't have enough fabric to make the hem in your video? If you find that you don't have much fabric to work with once you've flattened out your old hem, there is something that might help you. It's called hem tape or hem lace. This helps extend the length of your fabric as well as protect the raw edge of your garment. To hem your pants with hem lace, attach the lace to the outside of your fabric, end to end. Now, fold your pants leg to the line that you have marked. The lace should cover the edge of your fabric. Sew along the top edge of your lace and then press your new hem. When you're finished, it should look like this. And there you go. Two more tips to help you tailor your pants. Thanks so much for tuning in to this episode of The Nerd Closet, and I hope you'll tune in for the next Nerd Closet how-to. Thanks so much for watching my video, and I would like to extend a very special thank you to my very special patrons over on my Patreon page. If you'd like to see more Nerd Closet how-tos, then you can click the link right here. Or, if you have a question about how to do something, you can leave it in the comments section below, or you can send it to me on my Facebook and Twitter pages. Lastly, please check out my all-new website over at thenerdcloset.net.